shooting star I think I'd prefer the latter did any vlog type things okay my dog is trying to get in so and you're so demanding come on then stop licking that bin so since the last vlog i have this is how long it's been i've illustrated two books in that time frame so i illustrated this book rosie's magic umbrella and i illustrated this book the tree by the sea um so yeah i'm just gonna kind of show you some behind the scenes of um the first book i did which was rosie's magic umbrella um i finished that a few months ago and i just finished the third the other one then um so yeah i was just gonna talk a bit about that really and and show you some process behind it and um yeah finn can you please go to your bed Go into bed. Come on. Can you get into bed, please? driving me nuts anyway um yeah so yeah what else did i do in that whole big chunk of time so i went i got my vax i was i'm fully vaccinated now as of like a couple months ago so me and a couple of my friends who are all also vaccinated um went to amsterdam for a little like weekend trip which was lovely i have a few a bit of footage from that not lots but um it was just really nice to go on a plane. It was really strange, but really nice. Um, felt normal. Um, and yeah, it was lovely. I'd never been to Amsterdam or the Netherlands in general. So yeah, the food was amazing and it was just lovely. It was a very relaxed weekend. And it was nice to do after I'd finished the, the book and um, because I'd been working very hard on that. And um, so yeah. Um, I'm also now a full-time artist and illustrator. I finished up in my part-time job. Um, I worked in a cafe as a barista. Um, uh, so I worked there for four years, um, kind of just sustaining my business. I suppose. Well, I didn't, I didn't start my business while I was working there. I was still in college when I started working there. Um, and then from there, I kind of just got into freelancing and illustration and stuff. Now I'm kind of trying to see if I can do it full time because I just want to kind of put all my effort and time into it to try and like, you know, push things a little bit maybe. And um, so yeah, that was, I finished up there in June, July, July, early July, I think. Um, and I haven't freaked out yet. <laughs> so I've been kept busy, thankfully. Um, but I just know that the next time I get like a bit of a dry spell, I'm gonna be like, oh my god, I have nothing, no money coming in or something. But that's all part of it, really. Like sometimes you're gonna have good ones, sometimes you're not. So this is Rosie's Magic Umbrella, um, which I illustrated, and it was written by Karen Ryan. And I was so excited when Karen reached out to me about this because I just I loved the story. Um, it's full of adventure and fun, and um. I love those kind of things so and here's the back a child's imagination is a powerful tool but what if it really could take you anywhere so it starts off here 
There she is, holding an umbrella. Um, I created this um, tile page with, I actually did watercolor, and then I cut out shapes like raindrops, and that's how I did that. And that's what I did for a lot of these things, I kind of collaged with watercolor, um, because I wanted the watery texture of watercolor. But I wanted really solid shapes, so I tend to um, cut things out and make shapes from... So here's the first page. So as you can see here, these little pieces, bits down here, I they are made from watercolour and like I cut them out. And then I added digital work on top, so it was a real mix between um, digital and analogue, which is... Seems to be how my work is going in general. Um, this is probably my favourite spread. I just did like this lovely sea environment. I don't think you're a child. 
this thing? The group comes in on a white horse. So basically, they're just copying my bar mitzvah. Fuck it! He's got a super weird thing. Uh, well, long story short, I really would love this job. I'd love to kick in. Ah. Yeah. Newsflash, hey honey, I'll give you the world I'm the freak from the heat that you're looking for I'm the bad mother chica knocking at your door Like a T-O-Y, you speak and spell Kiss my lips and I won't tell Push my buttons, pull my string Anything you wish, I'm everything you need And if you like Ooh, it, well then I like it And if you love it, well then I love it And if you want Ooh, it, well then I want it Oh, why? 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 Cause I'm the new best thing I'm the new best thing Better than you've ever seen Oh, we're about to crash. <laughs> Bye, Amy. Bye. Ambitious. 30,000. Less. Less? Yeah. We're just, we really went. I think the funny thing is, is it called the Irish Yeah. 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 That is so ironic. Yeah, isn't it? The drunk buildings. Yeah. If you buy a houseboat, it's the boat. Oh. Well, it's so it's just boat. a house on water. Yeah. That is so cute. What about the ones that look like little boats? <laughs> yeah, and into the shared inbox.
copy that. memory. Oh, <laughs> oh,